Hello and welcome back to Fable of the Lost Chapters. This is part 24, I think? In the last part, we had to deal with all these minion buttholes. And let me tell you, I went and I bought the best armor, or close to it. Uh, like, the best weapon that I could buy, and I had a lot of money. And I still needed the help of all of my little ghost friends and these guards who I picked up along the way, and just... My god. It's these guys in specific. The, the other guys aren't so bad, but uh, we finally did it. Well, fuck you, archaeologist. Yes, I know the way into Barney Prison. I know everything, don't I? That's why I'm as good as dead if they find me again. Anyway, there's an ancient route into the prison through the Litchfield Graveyard. It hasn't been opened in centuries, but you'll have to figure that one out for yourself. I'm not sticking around here. I still know a few good hiding places. This archaeologist, just fucking. He's such a dick. He's like, oh, I like put in the quest card to come save me. And then he bitches about me saving him and taking him away from his Take hiding place. He's like, You're the one that asked for help, dick. Oh my god, that freaking quest though. You received a new quest card. Just, I can't even handle. It took me a good shit hour at least just to get all the right stuff and like get through it. I went through it like three times. <sighs> so hard. Come on, Peter Melania. Get it together. And that just makes me want to go and buy actual upgrades for my guy. Of course, I can't afford the ones that I want because you know, fuck me. Let's just get will ones. Let's see, attack spells. Let's get inflame. Uh, need some better stuff. Mm. Summon, I do use summon a lot. Ah, fuck it. That's good enough. What the hell just exploded? <laughs> ah, cool. I really have to do some of these side quests. Execution tree. Bandits are planning an ambush on the guard stick. Yeah, I'll do that. Kill oh, kill all the bandits? No. I don't know. Yeah. I want to be the one to kill people. Like good people, because I'm a bad guy. And maybe I'll just go marry what's her face. Lady Grey, I think. Nah, never mind. I don't want the boost. Like, fuck that, mate. What's going on with that traitor? He was, like, running back and forth. I was just so excited to hear the boost that I didn't even give. Where is this quest? Hold up. Hold up. What? What now? Wow! Yeah! Wow! There we go. Quests. Current quests. Graveyard path. To take that other shitty little quest I didn't even want. Um, let's just go to Bowerstone. I totally didn't need to take that other quest, but I did anyways. Not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. Yeah. We're gonna go marry Lady Grey. Even though I already have a wife in Bowerstone South, that doesn't mean I can't get one in Bowerstone North. They're like two completely different places of the same city. It's just Lady Grey is so evil. And I'm so evil. I need someone like her. Where is she? She bitch better not be asleep. There she is. Waving at the wall. Are you Lady Grey? Oh, that's beautiful. I knew you'd have a romantic soul. I don't even know what the hell I just gave her. Some heroes. Of course, a woman in my position can't marry into poverty. I'm not. The very least poor. one can expect is that a man will have his own house. I have my own house. It just has another wife in it. Ah, uh, do I have to buy another house now? I'm sure these two wives might get along, maybe. There's 
there's no reason to say they shouldn't get along. Oh, that guy's freaking crazy. What a dick move game. It makes me go all the way back to the Heroes Guild, only to run all the way back again to where I just About was. Time you showed up. The execution. Oh, I walked on to that one quest that I kind of accepted on accident. Oh well. Hey, it's killing people, so that's kind of fun. Killing guards, no less. Even more fun. Oh, these poor guys. I was protecting them last mission. From those scary minions. Hey, don't, don't, don't even think of he killed one of my guys. He killed him. The execution tree. I don't know what this execution tree thing is. For freedom! For freedom! So these guys are going to an exe ex the execution tree to get freedom? I'm confused. I don't even know where this execution tree is or what it is. But I know it's a tree, so I'm on to something. Oh shit, this great sword. Oh, I killed all, all the bandits. Maybe they should wear something other than, like, cloth. And they wouldn't die so fast. Hey, hey, no. It's a bad guard. Oh, oops. Now I have a minion friend. Don't you dare sh- oh, I hate you. What's the point of you, minion, if all you do is get blocked? Okay, he's dead. I literally just kill these guys in like three hits. Minion, there's really no point to you. Oh, what? Is this? This is a mill. This can't be the execution tree. so much will. I'm actually curious to what my guy looks like with his helmet off. I don't think I've taken that thing off for like ages. Hey, didn't I, didn't I just say to not wear that? Hmm. Yep, my guy's pretty spooky. I'll keep my helmet off for a while. His head just looks so weird without something on it. Because he's bald. That was a bad decision on my part. I need to give him, like, a mohawk or something terrifying. Oh, shit, there's a lot of you guys. Oh, ooh, I know just what to use on you. Come here, everybody, let's party. Yeah! Oh, man. That didn't kill anybody. I'm sure we're like one hit away, but... The annoying thing about having all these guards is that at least four of them will go off and they'll start to crossbow you from a distance. And, I mean, that's fun because every arrow that hits you kind of like knocks you back a little, so you can't really do anything while being knocked back. So why not? Let's just have them repeatedly shoot arrows at me not be able to do anything. It's just game developing at its finest. Those choices. Is that the guy we're trying to save? I'm pretty sure I've seen him before. Oh no, that piece of wood is awfully menacing. I don't get it. This isn't a tree at all. There's a tree, but it's not the execution tree. They don't kill him on the tree. Oh, this guy's going to get it. Yay! I thought I was for it. Cheers, mate. Cheers. You and me are equally ugly. 
So my guy is riddled with scars on the face. It's actually kind of badass, I'm not going to lie. Alright, well, I guess that was something to do while I ran all the way back. Now to Litchfield Graveyard. Is that a demon door? What do you have to say? I see a demon door on the map. There he is. Let me talk to you. Leave me alone, you organic bastard. Uh. I only open for Nostro, the ancient guardian of the door. Okay, so I have to dress like someone, I guess? I don't know. People live here? At the graveyard? Why? You have a house set? That must be worth a bleeding fortune. Yeah, I smashed open the crypt and it was only just nine. Oh, you're gonna die. To hide it to make sure no one else steals it. Oh, I will steal it. No one's going to find it. Not even them undead what's wandering around. Only thing I didn't manage to hide before they turned up was the helmet. It'll be alright here for now, and I'm keeping them gates locked till I can sell the lot. What was that? Someone's out there. I better go. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> Get out of my house, you bloody peasant. Oh, convincing. Alright, I'm leaving. I just needed somewhere to sleep. Did he not see me? I was standing right there. I'm this big, terrifying guy with, like, the biggest electrifying great axe. He just walked past me and didn't even see me. This isn't what I've been doing quests for. Bitch, you should recognize me. Oh, hello. Uh, guild business, is it, hey? Hmm? I you want, want that to go helmet. Old kingdom gates? I tell you, they ain't been opened for generations. They say that only Nostro the gatekeeper could open them. But old Nostro died a couple of hundred years ago. Now, the secret's buried with him in his crypt. Yeah, the crypt I suppose open, he'll be wanting access to the graveyard. Mm. Well, let's go. Alright, we'll go. But I will be back. And I'm stealing that helmet. Oh, the hell is going to be mad? Nostro's crypt is on the far side of the graveyard. Over the river and up the hill. You can just wait here. Well, I go steal that helmet back. <laughs> gimme, gimme, gimme. Nostro's helmet. Uh-oh. Oh, a big scary thing. He's so clumsy. I can't believe he just left his house. He's like, I'm just gonna stay in my house and make sure no one steals his helmet. And then the first thing he does is it, he like leaves his house. Let's me take it. I'm sure there's some method to his madness. Oh right, I'm supposed to be digging. After I find all these pieces... Ooh, I do like those tattoos. After I find all the pieces to Nostra's suit, I can go to that demon door, too. Just hope that, uh... Oh god, these guys come in out of nowhere. I just hope that the quest doesn't, like, continue. Regardless of me getting all this stuff. Want to spade here, please. Okay, I can spade here apparently. Oh, you took one like little dig thing. Dug once, and then he's like, "Oh, my back." Well, I'm not gonna go to his crypt because I already know that the dick like took everything. 
health potion call it. I bother digging there for a health potion. Ooh, these kind of look conspicuous. I wish I had my dog in this game. I wish this was Fable 2. Man, this would be a lot better. Oh, hold on, hold on, enemy. Let me dig here first. <laughs> He's just standing there like, okay, I'll wait. Silver key. These guys aren't even hard, they die in two hits. They're just inconvenient because they freaking pop up everywhere. I can't believe it made me face the minions before these guys. These guys are like... They're like nothing compared to minions. I think with all of my all of my heart I can absolutely say that I hate minions the most in this game. More than Balverines. More than Hobbs. Just, uh, fuck. I push that open. Another silver key. Great. Alright, well, we'll continue looking around this graveyard in the next part. See you guys then.